Hey, what's good, my friends? I got a question for you today. Have you ever found yourself pretty, um, I don't know, upset by the choices that other people are making? Yeah, maybe once or twice, right? So this has been a learning experience for me, and I got something special I want to share with you today. It's absolutely going to transform and blow your mind. Okay, maybe not. You've probably heard about it before, but I guarantee you that will give you more ease with the people in your life that are making choices that might disturb you. So I got a couple things for you today. Okay, first thing is first. People are going to choose what people are going to choose. I know it sounds silly, right? But how many times have you tried to take somebody and like force them into a situation or try to get like your kid to do something for you? <laughs> Nobody in this room has had that issue before. <laughs> anyway, um, you know, you, you find that when, when you try to get somebody to do something for you or, you know, you try to push them into a situation, what do they do, right? They push back. They push back right away and like how difficult is that in your life when you're trying to get somebody to do something and they're not doing it for you. That's why like it's been such a huge learning experience for me in my business and in my transformation over the last just few months alone. Looking at the fact that people are going to choose what they're going to choose, right? And so if people don't do anything, they're also going to have a slew of justifications and reasons why they're not actually making that choice or that decision to move forward. And, and what are you going to do? You're going to battle with them on their story or are you going to let them go do what they're going to do? You know, how much of you battling them is actually going to be validating somebody's reality and the fact that they have to battle and uphold their justifications for not making a choice. So what's the kindness? Like what's the thing that you can do to unlock all of this for you, have more ease in your life, and give that person the freedom to make their choices and not feel judged? Well, it's simple really, right? First thing, don't judge a person by what they're making their choices on. And you know what? If you think that there's a better choice that they can make, that's actually you acting superior to the person that you're judging, right? If you think that you know better than somebody else and what they're going to do for their life, you're actually acting like the superior asshole, <laughs> right? So you're actually like saying, I know better than you. You don't know how to do your life. I'm going to tell you what's better for you. And if you don't do it, you're not as good as I am. See, that's what a lot of people are doing. People always want to judge other people on their lives and how they're performing and how things are showing up for them as if you know better than anybody else, right? So how much fun is that for you? to do that with other people? Like how much more time does that take out of your day to judge somebody else about the actions and choices that they're making? Don't you have a life to live? <laughs> That's my question, right? So that's my tip for the day is basically like stop judging people for the choices that they're making because they're going to make the choices. And what if that choice is actually something that somebody needs to learn or go through in their path or their journey to finding something totally different, right? I know for me, it's like my parents told me all these things that I should totally do when I was growing up. And what did I, what did I do? I went out and did the opposite, right? So I would you know, I would run across the fence in the backyard and fall off after they told me like, you know, if you fall off, you're going you're gonna to get hurt. But what did I have to do? I had to get hurt first. You know, so you have to be willing to let people get hurt, let people make stupid decisions, let people create reasons and justifications for not creating what's actually possible in their life because that's how they're going to learn, you know. And that's the greatest service that you can be to other people is to let them do what they're going to do. So that's it for my video today. If you found this to be a useful video, go ahead and send it to one of your friends. Maybe you know somebody that you have in mind that uh, would benefit from this. Or absolutely, um, if you want to see more of my videos, then subscribe using the link above. And also click over here to watch yesterday's video. So thanks so much for watching my stuff. I look forward to talking to you, to you tomorrow. I think it's day number 24 of my 90-day video blogging challenge with the Empower Network. And... Uh, I'm just loving it, and I'm loving all the feedback that I'm getting from you. So uh, take care. I will talk to you soon. Bye.